So, it's uh, it's been a while. Just a little five months, going on six now. Within those months of me being MIA, I had some serious shit come into play and I had to reevaluate everything. Now this is a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down and... Jumping back to the start of the year, I uh, ended up getting a little sick. It was on my second day off of work. The day before, I had gone nowhere. And the day before that, also nowhere. So with that in mind, I didn't think much about it. But then a day passes and then I just wake up completely wrecked. Later on that same day, I end up making an appointment so that way I could get checked to see what the fuck I have. They end up hitting me up 20 minutes later once I've gotten home. Through a text message, they let me know I had COVID. Me having this, I wasn't afraid for my health, but rather the others around me. Unfortunately, the others in my household also ended up getting it as well. My stepdad, three days later, ended up starting to feel it. And then four days after that, my mother ended up starting to have issues with constant heavy coughing that was just painful to hear. With her, seven to eight months ago, she ended up having a kidney transplant. With a kidney transplant, they require your body to have little to no immune system so that way your body doesn't reject it. We end up taking her to a hospital. They ended up testing her and she came out positive for COVID as well, along with pneumonia from it. Pneumonia is where liquid gets into the air sacs of the lungs, limiting the ability to take in oxygen, causing shortness of breath along with heavy coughing. As the days passed, the hospital would check and see if there's any positive improvement in the lungs. And they kept it honest with us. It's either it's going to go well and they're going to be improving or it's not going to improve and she's going to have to go on a ventilator. With all this going on and all this information being shared, I, I was just destroyed. I didn't do much, honestly. I was allowed to take time off of work. And with that time, I would go and see her. The times I wasn't seeing her, I was just at home laying down with all my thoughts to myself. There was constant clashing going on in my mind that it's my fault. It's all my fault. I caused this. The other half of my mind was just saying that it's not her time. This is not the time that she's going to make it. Everything's going to be good. It was just constant back and forth of it everything's okay she she was gonna be okay along with what if it, she doesn't i'm trying to record this without my sad emotions take control but it's pretty difficult having to rethink upon these events but thankfully her health was improving as the days went by a week later her lungs were doing way better and she was allowed to come home. She wasn't at 100%. She came home with some spare oxygen tanks and an oxygen machine. So from January to April, I was spending the majority of the time with family and with my mother. And for the time I wasn't, my buddies had got me into watching a little bit of anime. If I wasn't watching anything with them, I was out jogging, working on my own health. With just two months of cardio, I was able to drop my weight from 187 to 160. And that's pretty much it. That's what's happened between the last video and now. And when it comes to my mother's health, she no longer needs to use the oxygen equipment and is now able to move around on her own. I have plans on some videos to start working on and hopefully I could get to them sooner than later. And with this all being said, that's the end of this video. I just wanted to recap and inform anyone who cares to watch any of my content as to what the fuck happened and why did I disappear. Oh, and uh, here's this extra clip. Nah, it's not. It's nothing good. Bruh. Well, 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 well. What was that? Oh, wait, what? Oh! Bro! Alright, that's dope as fuck. Fire. Fire. It's actually kind of fire. Oh, shit. It's <laughs> milked in a rage right now. <laughs> Milk Dud didn't fucking leave and joined here. He would've been pissed. What'd you get? Uh, just parts. Nothing special. Uh, easy, easy, easy Australian. Hey babe, guess what I just got? <laughs>
I got an Australian scatter gun.